Scorpio, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your weekly tarot forecast for the week of March 14th through to about the 20th, 2022. This is a reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. All right, guys, let's see what you have coming up for this week. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Welcome to all of you. Thank you so much for joining me. If you're not subscribed, please do subscribe. Also, please give this video a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate that. What does Leo have coming up for this week, please? Leo. First card out, we have the Page of Pentacles. All right, let's see. News coming in for some of you. Okay, so we have the Four of Swords, we have the Three of Pentacles, we have the Emperor. Some of you may be dealing with an Aries. Let's see. We have the Page of Swords. Why am I not surprised, Leo? We have the Queen of Cups. Interesting. We have the Magician, and we have the Ace of Pentacles. These landed sideways. Let's see what the overall energy is for Leo, please, for the week. What is the overall energy? The Nine of Pentacles. Very nice. Independent energy. Some of you are definitely going back to work or there is a job opportunity here. It's a very interesting spread. I do see a delay. This could be a delay with communication. Uh, there could be news or an offer that comes in and then as far as you may be replying back, Leo, you may take your time. You may not be in a hurry, and that could be because maybe you're doing well. Nine of Pentacles, there's some sort of status that you hold. Maybe you're a business owner. And so, yeah, I'm getting multiple different things with this. Look at this, though. We have the chariot at the bottom of the deck. So, I mean, maybe you have to travel. So this could be a work opportunity that's coming in uh, some of you maybe you have to travel for this job we see movement but um, I also feel like there is a delay here so you may receive news or you may receive um, an offer but maybe you don't start the job right away or maybe you don't reply back right away there is some sort of delay Leo. We have the chariot. We also have the king of pentacles. We have the six of cups and there's the two of cups. So I do see a reunion Okay, we have the Two of Cups. If I keep going, we have the Two of Swords. So, uh, Two of Swords. You could be dealing with someone who maybe is very guarded, very protective of themselves, but this also could be you. We have the Ten of Cups here. So, I'm reading for some Leos where you're single, you're looking good, you're feeling good, some of you very happy, uh, there's a lot of coins here, and so, yeah, I mean, some of you are doing quite well financially, you may um, sit in a higher level position, or maybe you're a business owner, you're looking good, Leo, and maybe maybe someone around you is noticing that. Now, for some of you, this, this can be a reunion, but for others, this could be someone brand new. Um, but what I'm seeing here is that either you or this other person maybe is afraid of getting hurt. Someone is very guarded. Could be you, especially if you have money. Uh, this could be you, you know, if someone is coming in, 
we definitely see you a little hesitant here. But the chariot is, is a card of victory. The chariot is, is you in the driver's seat. You can, you know, steer this chariot wherever you want to go. Here this week, you could be looking at a couple of options. You know your worth with the nine of pentacles. This is self-sufficient energy here. And so news is coming in. We have the four of swords here. Some of you are going back to work others um there's an opportunity here but i think you're gonna take a moment leo like i mentioned earlier i see a delay here i see you sleeping on this here a little bit you know i see you definitely taking a moment so you may not reply back to this person right away or whatever it is there's some sort of delay here they may be at a distance For some of you, this is a work, this is a work matter. You have the three of pentacles, the ace of pentacles, page of pentacles. Um, if not work, this could be school. Maybe you're waiting to go back to school, something like that. Others, you're trying to make some changes within your career and um, you could be waiting on working with a person, a particular person, or even multiple other people you're waiting. Maybe you're waiting on them. I do see you waiting while you're waiting. Um, I do see you making money, not settling. That could be why you're waiting. There could be an opportunity in front of you, but it's very small. Maybe you know you won't make a ton of money and you're already you know sitting in a, in a good place financially speaking and so you may pass on something with the page of swords and the four of swords listen to your intuition queen of cups yeah some of you may pass on something that's what i'm getting and then others um you may you may take a moment here and you may think about this for those of you where it's a job opportunity, maybe you have to take some classes or you have to go back to school, whatever it is. There could be something like that here, and so you need to think about it. Ace of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. Some of you are looking at multiple job opportunities, and so one of them, you may, you may have something in front of you, Leo, we are... You know, maybe the the salary is is isn't isn't that great. It's not it's not um, a lot of money. But then you have another opportunity where you know maybe it's higher pay, but the hours aren't aren't the best. There's something like that. I think you need some time to think this uh, through. Yeah, I mean, maybe even some of you um, thinking about maybe returning to a, a past job, an old position, something like that. You may have to travel for this. Or do you want to start something brand new? I am definitely reading for some business owners where you are going to be like branching out expanding uh, and then for others this is you starting something new I think you're contemplating something else here but no matter how you resonate this is very very positive it's probably the best spread that I've seen for you guys in a while so money coming in i see i see you definitely taking a break here for some of you this is like you emotionally and mentally um recharging definitely uh i definitely see that and those of you that are expanding your business or maybe even accepting a new a new job opportunity here I think that this has real potential as far as um, bringing in maybe more financial stability or security or for you to continue to maintain 
um, what you have and increase that you know what I mean so this is very nice this is very nice uh, and you have some characters here. So Queen of Cups, you could be dealing with a Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. Cancer is coming through. Um, but then we also have the King of Pentacles here at the bottom of the deck. So the King of Pentacles, the Emperor, may be the same person. This could be a Taurus for some of you that's significant. Others, an Aries could be significant. Or you could be dealing with a couple of characters here. King of Pentacles and the Emperor. Uh, some of you are definitely moving up within your career. You could be moving into a higher level position. This could be a promotion that's coming in. You're moving up the ladder. Some money coming in for, for those of you that were waiting. There's money coming in. Some of you are actually maybe able to finally take a break you know you feel you feel comfortable now at this time so you're able to take a break but let's pull you let's pull you some additional guidance cards for leo please it's a very good reading you have the magician here so you have everything you need when it comes to uh creating new opportunities for yourself or making changes, growing, expanding, whatever it is that you're doing in business. I see you having uh, that Midas touch right now, Leo. Also, I see you empowered. You definitely are holding the, the reins here with the Emperor and the Chariot showing up. Right, let's see, what else does Leo need to know? So we do have Capricorn and we have Aries coming through. So that King of Pentacles may be a Capricorn for some of you. Um, we also have Aries. First quarter moon in Capricorn, unleash your kindest self. And then we have last quarter moon in Aries, work through your feelings. Interesting. With the chariot here, um... It's all about control. And so, I mean, if you are maybe feeling more emotional at this time, we are in Pisces season. So, you know, maybe some of you have um, maybe some Pisces placements in your chart or something like that. But if you're feeling more emotional, I do feel like you will ground your energy, definitely. And you have the chariot here. So you could be reining in these emotions. All right, let's pull you one of these. For Leo, additional guidance for Leo. flow 24 hmm interesting so this is a six which is great these vibes are very very positive maybe you know maybe it's taken you a long time to get here leo with the chariot this is a card of victory but there was some sort of a battle prior and, you know, maybe, maybe, you know, this, this path has been a long, windy road. There's been, you know, lots of twists and turns, and it just has not been easy. But things are definitely feeling lighter and easier here at this point. And, I, and again, maybe some of you are finding finally able to take some sort of break at this time money's coming in things are looking good 
Let's see what signs you're dealing with, Leo. Go with the flow with this card. Be open to change. You do have a lot of very uh, controlling energy here. So just make sure that you are being adaptable and flexible and all of that. I do see communication this week. We have Scorpio. So this Queen of Cups for some of you definitely can be a Scorpio. And then we have Gemini. All right, Leo, I hope that you found this reading helpful. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and make sure you are subscribed. All right, guys.